Hey there guys, what is up everybody? So I'm just going to let everyone know that I had so much fun yesterday and I got so lucky with the pulls that I got that I decided to do a, another opening today. It's not going to be quite as big as yesterday was because I don't have another booster box on hand but I'm going to be doing two more sword and shield elite trainer boxes and as another bonus i went to my local walmart today and i just i happened to find a what is this a burning shadows booster box just sitting on the you know just sitting there so i decided to get that too so yeah i will crack open those after i do a quick recap of what i found yesterday yesterday i got pretty lucky with my openings so i will go over those real quick yesterday i got pretty lucky with my openings i got a really nice gold zamazenta give me one second to focus that One second. It will not focus for some reason. That is a little better. So, yesterday I got a gold Zamazenta V, which is a good draw in itself. I got a Rainbow Professor's Research, a Full Art Team Yell Grunt. A uh, Rushram and Zekrom GX, an Oracorio GX, a uh, Blastoise and Piplup GX, a Megalopini and Jigglypuff, a uh, Togepi, a Cleffa and Igglybuff, a Flygon GX, another Zassian V, which I already drew the other day, a Sableye V, and I got a handful of full art cards, including a Steelix, a Gallade, a Mimic U. An Exadrill, and I got a really cool holographic Ultra Necrozma, and just some of the other cool cards I got: a holographic Inteleon, holographic Bolton, a Reverse Empoleon, a holographic Galarian Berserker, and a holographic Copper Jaw. But yeah, obviously, obviously the highlight of yesterday was definitely. The Zamazenta Gold. Sorry, let me center that. This I can't believe how beautiful this card actually is. And the fact that I pulled that and that in, I think, two to three packs is just astounding. But let's get into the drawings today. Let me crack these bad boys open real quick. As you can see, they're all, all factory sealed, all legit things. Uh, all that extra 
extra crap can go. Just get the packs. Let's see what we got here. Snorlax. Snorlax. Zamazenta. Zacian. Two Lapras packs. Ooh, beautiful. I got two Zamazenta, two Zacian, and two Lapras and two Snorlax packs. So I got two of each. I don't know if that's like how it is every time, everyone that you draw, but I will, I don't know, I'll find out. Let's see what I get in the next one, too. Just throw all this shit next to me. Let's crack this one open now. Also factory sealed, so you can tell that it's legit. Get all these packs together, you know? Now, like I said, I haven't been doing this for too long, so the pool that I got yesterday is extremely lucky, and, you know, I'm hoping to have good luck with this one today, too, as well. I heard a lot of people have luck with the Sword and Shield. I heard a lot of people are getting a lot of good pulls from it, so I'm hoping my luck continues today, because another gold card, another gold or another rainbow card today would be pretty awesome. Let's see what I got with this one. I assume it's just going to be two of everything again. Yeah, there's two Zacian, two Zamazenta, two Lapras, and two Snorlax again. Let's put those back there. Just to show everyone all the packs I'm going to be opening today. And then we crack open this last booster box. The amount of money I've spent on Pokemon cards this past month and a half to two months is absolutely astounding. Oh, actually, give me two seconds. Let me change the title of the stream real quick, because that was yesterday's title. That's better. So yeah, as I said before, I haven't been doing uh, pack openings too long, so I've actually never opened any of these Crimson Invasion sets, so I don't know what the pull rates are or anything in there, but, you know, I'm going to find out, see if I get anything good. For the eight packs out, ho-ho. I'm going to save the Ho-Ho packs for last because, you know, I just feel like I'd have the best luck with those. Yeah, I have eight. Okay. So, give me... So, those are all the packs that I will be opening today. Let's get right into this guys I'm gonna set the burning shadows to the side I'm gonna say those for last because I've never opened those before and I'm gonna start with the sword and shield okay let's get these cracking you know yep I've opened so many packs recently, and I still suck pretty bad at opening these. Two, three, four from the back. Let's see.
Let's get that to focus a little better. That's better. Dwacky, a Cockney, a Chudo, Rhyhorn, a Rookity, a Krabby, a Reverse Goldine, and a regular rare Sanaconda. Oh, you know, not the start I was expecting, but I'm going to put all rares and reverses to the side because I like to keep those separate. Ooh, got a little laggy there for a second. Good old fire energy. Crushing hammer, Kingler, Hyper Potion, Nicket, Baltoy, Chimchow, Krabby, Minchino, a reverse Nicket, and another holographic copper jaw. I have drawn this two days in a row. You know, I'm not upset about it. Cool looking card, nice hollow. It'd be cool to get the reverse of that, but I will take whatever I can get at this point. I know Sword and Shield will be on sale for a long time, so I'm hoping that I can complete this set at some point. I will continue to buy these as I can, you know, with everything going on in the world. I can't just keep buying these week and over and over again like I would like to. Four from the back. Nice psychic energy. Mantine. Dottler. Corsus. Cor Visquire. Ponita. A Sobble. Maractus. A Mudbray. A Ponyard. A Reverse Rhydon. And a regular rare Cloister. Yeah. Wow. Three packs in and haven't got in a hollow or anything yet. So. Not looking the greatest. That's okay. No worries. I have faith. Four from the back. Ooh. I did see something there. I didn't mean to, but I do see the discoloration on the back, so hopefully it's something new. Hopefully, I mean, if it's a regular G, GX, EX, hopefully it's one that I don't have already. A reverse Sizzlepeed. And a regular Snorlax V. You know, I will take that. Not a terrible looking card. Snorlax is always a fan favorite. I'll put both of those to the side. How's everybody doing tonight, though? Everyone having a good night? How's uh, everyone handling the quarantine? If you can't watch and you miss anything, I will be posting this VOD right on YouTube right after this is done. So if you miss anything or you miss a big card drop and you want to see it or something along those lines, it will be there to watch later. And my YouTube is linked below. Let's see. See if my luck will start to change. Those to the side. Pal Pen. Kingler. Ghastly. Ponyard. A Sizzlepeed. A Yamper. Clobopus. Ooh, a Reverse Lucky Egg and a Holographic Cinderace. I actually haven't pulled the Reverse Lucky Egg yet. So that is a good pull. I will take that. I mean, there's nothing I can really do about it now, so I kind of got to take it anyways, but you know what I'm saying. I got three packs left from the first Elite Trainer box. I'm just hoping I didn't use all my luck up yesterday and I could pull at least something good out of these three Elite Trainer Boxes. Shield Energy, Pokey Gear 
Roar Energy, Ferrothorn, a Grookey, a Mudbray, a Hoot Hoot, Pinsurchin, a Vulpix, a Reverse Boltund, and a regular rare Morpeko. So I have pulled two holographic Boltons and a reverse Bolton yesterday and today. Very popular card, or just very common in this set, but like I said, I'll take pretty much anything. Not too picky about cards, I just would like one good pull from, at least one good pull each from each trainer box would be really nice, but you know, beggars can't be choosers. Good old water type energy, a heat more, a metal saucer, quick ball, a Muna, a Snom, a Grookey, a Shelder, Mawile, a Reverse Minicino, and another Zassian V. I pulled three of these cards now. You know, I feel like it's more common than it should be. Quite honestly, I feel like it's definitely more common than it should be. All right. Last pack of the first Elite Trainer Box. God, I am still terrible at opening these packs. I am absolutely awful. I mean, I pulled two V cards out of this lead trainer box, so, you know, I feel like the peop the bigger people that open these have a lot better luck than I've had with these, but that makes sense, obviously, but fighting type energy, a B-sharp, a Salazzle, a Doug Trio, a Cotney, a Score Bunny, a Silicobra, a Yamper, a Grookey, a reverse Diglett, and a regular rare or beetle. So, not exactly what I was hoping for out of that first Elite Trainer box, but, you know, you, like I said, you know. You know how it is. Sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. Hopefully, this second Elite Trainer box will go better. I got two V cards out of the first Elite Trainer box, and I'm hoping to pull something a little better out of this one. Hey, what is up? S. I don't really know what that's supposed to say, so I will not try to guess it. Rhyhorn. Minichino. Chinchow. Krogunk. Galarian Meow. A reverse Masharna. And a full art BD card. I will take that. I do not have this full art yet. Smash. I will call you Smash. That is a cool name. Okay, at least one Elite Trainer box down. At least I have a full art card to speak of. My dog is barking outside. Yeah, it's not. I mean, it's not the greatest. It looks cool. Let me let me let my dog in real quick. Come on, buddy. Where you going? Okay. You know, my day's been pretty good actually. I oh well. A regular rare Cramorant is the rare this stack, this stack, so. But, you know, it could be worse. Went to the store, got some more cards, you know, the usual. It's usually how most of my days have been going. How has your day been, Smash? I would love to hear all about it. My day would be going a lot better if I could pull uh, another gold or a rainbow card out of this. At least one of these three Elite Trainer boxes. 
You probably weren't here for the start of this, but I bought two more Sword and Shield Elite Trainer Boxes today because I had crazy luck with it yesterday. And I was hoping to have as much luck today as I did, but it doesn't look like it's going that way at this moment. Yesterday I pulled... Very cold. It was snowing this morning here in Canada. Oh, you're from Canada? Nice. I've been to Canada plenty of times. But yeah, it was just snowing here in New York the other day. Actually, it snowed for like two to three days in a row, I think. But yesterday I was... I bought two Elite Trainer Boxes and I opened a Booster Box for like my first big pack opening. I pulled... Ooh, another Intellion Hollow. I have pulled one of these yesterday. But I pulled a gold Zamazenta V and a rainbow Professor's Research and a bunch of like full art cards. So yesterday went honestly really well for my first big card opening. And I was hoping today would go just as well. But you know, it doesn't seem like it, but I'll keep hope. I also am opening 50 online packs after this from my big opening yesterday. My friend asked me to do an online one, too, and I will do that when I'm done here. Linoon, Rotom Bike, Drizzile, Ghastly, Rookity, Sizzlipede, Asnam, a Maywile, another Reverse Rayhorn, and a regular Rare Drapion. Yes, I know. It's actually, it's actually gone up in price, too. Like, that card's, like, worth, like, a pretty good amount of money right now. Like, I've seen it been going for, like, 40-plus bucks online. Which is more than a booster box cost, or an elite trainer box cost itself. So, hopefully I can pull another one and I can just sell one. But, if I don't pull another one, I'm just going to keep it. At some point, I will probably get some more booster boxes of... Sword and Shield, just because of the luck that I have had with it. And plus, with the new set coming out, these ones should drop a little in money. You know, I'll try to keep myself busy during all this free time that I have. Gossip Flower, Goldeen Diglett, Scurruppy, Hoot Hoot, a Reverse Stunk Fish, and a Regular Rare Noctowl. Yeah, like I said, I, I think the most I've seen it go for is, like, I think I saw a couple people get, like, almost 50 bucks for it online, like, on TCG Player, people sell cards. And I think I saw people getting them for almost, like, selling them for almost, like, 50 plus dollars. Actually, let me crack my window. It's a little warm in here. Yeah, yesterday I opened two Elite Trainer boxes of Sword and Shield, and I opened a full booster box of Cosmic Eclipse, Sun and Moon Cosmic Eclipse, because that was my favorite set of cards. So I opened 52 packs of cards yesterday. And then when I was at the store today, I decided I wanted to do another opening, just because of how much fun I had and the luck that I had. So I'm hoping to have a little better luck. I have two packs after this and then i have eight sun and moon burning shadows because walmart my local walmart decided to have an elite trainer box of that still so i thought what the heck just pick it up silicobra minichino a vulpix a mana a reverse diglet again and a full art in ddv I actually don't have this card yet, so that is a good pull, too. I actually really like this card, too. I love the purple. That card, I think, is going for 5 to 10 bucks online right now. Yeah, honestly, I feel like anywhere but, like, I don't know. I feel like America isn't the greatest at it either, but I feel like just random stores will have it. I'm trying to find what I did with all my card sleeves so I can throw some sleeves on them. I don't remember where I put them. So I will just open a new pack of card sleeves.
Have you ever opened uh, the Burning Shadow set? I've never opened it. But, like I said, I saw a random, like, elite trainer box at my local Walmart. And I'm like, you know, what the heck. I might as well pick her up. I, I wonder what, like, the pull rates are for that. I know the pull rates for Sword and Shield have been really good. That's why I've been so into, like, opening these. But, yeah, give me one second. I'm just putting all the... The hollows that I got so far in sleeves and stuff and the V cards. But yeah, I hope it's good. Honestly, I hope it's good. If I could pull something out of those, especially because I feel like they're not too easy to find, it'd be pretty awesome. Put all these in the sleeves real quick, and I'm going to open the rest. Really? They have a Charizard in there? Oof. If I... <laughs> I would freak out if I pulled a Charizard. Like, let's be real. If I pulled a Charizard out of any pack, honestly, any pack, I would probably be pretty fucking ecstatic about it. Oop, probably shouldn't be swearing. I would be pretty ecstatic about it, not going to lie. Thor, come on, bud. Oh. All right, let's finish open these. So all those are in sleeves now. Okay. I have two more sword and shield packs, and then I have eight of the burning shadows. Let's see. Fighting type energy, a Doppler. Regular potion, Hitmonchan. Score Bunny, Sinisty, Maractus, a Pikachu. Another Galarian Meow. A reverse Crushing Hammer and a regular rare Turpinator. All right. This is my last Sword and Shield pack. Okay, let's see if I can get lucky here. Haunter. Vitality Band, Clobopus, a Wooloo, a Sobble, a Pinsir Chin, a Blip Bug, a Reverse Rotom Bike, and a regular Poltergeist. Okay, so not the greatest Elite Trainer boxes there are, but, you know, I did pull a Full Art BD, an Indeedy V, Another Zassian V. This is my third one of these that I've pulled in the past, I don't know, like two weeks. Snorlax V, a nice hollow Copper Jaw, a nice hollow Inteleon, and a nice hollow Incinerace. Set those to the side. Oh, do you want to... Oh, no, I don't have that. I can show you what I pulled yesterday, though. So yesterday, like I said, I opened, what was it? I opened two Sword and Shield Elite Trainer boxes and a full booster box of Cosmic Eclipse. And I got a Gold Zamazenta, which I love, a Rainbow Professor's Research, which is going for, I think like 17 bucks, a Full Art Team Yell Grunt, a Reshram and Zekrom GX, an Oricorio GX, a Blastoise and Piplup GX, I love that artwork, Megalopunny and Jigglypuff, Togepi, Cleffa, and Igglybuff, a Flygon GX, 
another Zassian V, a Sableye V, and I pulled a Full Art Steelix, a Full Art Gallade, a Full Art Mimikyu, a Full Art Excadrill, and a really cool Ultra Necrozma holographic. Another Inteleon holographic, a Bolton holographic, and I really like the reverse Empoleon. A holographic Galleon Berserker, another Copper Jaw, and a holographic Sanaconda. Yeah, that was yesterday with two Elite Trainer boxes and a full booster box. I was so devastated. I really thought I would pull more with all those cards, honestly. Especially after watching so many people open packs, like I've been watching it a lot. And I feel like their their pick like their pull rates for rares and everything have, are like so high. And I'm thinking like, you know, maybe I can get lucky and pull some great stuff. And I just feel like I'm not pulling anything other than those two cards, obviously. So now I have eight Burning Shadows packs. I'm going to save the Ho-Ho ones for last because I feel like those will have the best luck. Oh, wow. That one ripped right open, actually. I think the trick is still four from the back on these. It is. Okay. Leaf Energy. Plumeria. Seedra. A Wobbuffet. A Magikarp. Panseer, a Cutie Fly, a Pan Power, Pikachu, a Reverse Super Scoop Up, and a Regular Rare Mudsdale. Okay, not the best start. I hope so. I honestly hope so. Like, I, I haven't looked at the sets for these, but I assume there's a Full Art Ho-Ho card in this set. And if I could pull, honestly, any Ho-Ho, even like if it was just like a normal Hollow or anything like that, would be cool. The Legendary Birds and the Legendary Dogs are probably like my favorite Legendaries in all of Pokemon, so. A Wick. Escape Rope. Bufalant. A Porygon. A Lowen Rattata. Charmander. A Pansare. A Pikachu, a Reverse Morello, and a Regular Rare Meow Stick. Awesome. Oof. Not looking too great, honestly. Not looking too great. One, two, three, four, five. So I have six packs left. And like I said, I will be going on to my online Pokemon game and opening 50 packs from yesterday. I will be opening all those today. I don't know, just something, even like a normal hollow at this point would be cool coming from this pack, or this set. My luck isn't looking the greatest. Classic Hoot Hoot. Classic Meryl with a Stitch design, a Porygon, a Charmander, a Reverse Shinotic, which is actually, that's actually a pretty cool card. And a, another regular rare. Not even getting hollows, man. If I, if I go through packs, this whole Elite Trainer Box, and don't even get like a hollow or anything like that, oof. I will be so distraught. Someone will have to pick me up off of the floor because of how upset I would be. Good old fighting energy. Another wick. Ooh, Sviper. Mudbray. A sock. Taganamaru, a Wimpod, another Alone Rattata, a Reverse Pan Power, another regular rare, man. Unbelievable. 
Yeah, but I mean, like, it's an elite trainer box, so you you gotta feel like you'd at least get some, at least one really good pull from it. Because what's the point of even selling them, you know? You get eight packs. I got four packs left. Put those back there. Oh my god, a Letty Ba, what a classic. Letty Ba was literally one of my favorite Pokemon for some reason when it came out. I don't know why, I just always had a fascination with Letty Ba. Alana. Tormenting Spray. That is a cool Heat More. I pulled a lot of Heat Mores, and seeing all the cool artworks is actually pretty cool. A Horsey, classic. A Venipede, Sandy Gast, a Reverse Seviper, and an another regular rare Persian. Oh man, I might collapse. Oh <sighs> man. This Elite Trainer box is Crimson Rush. I wonder why they're still sitting on the, sitting on the shelves at Walmart. No one wants to buy these freaking pieces of garbage. Sorry, just organizing a little bit. Four from the back. That's what I'm saying. At least give me like a hollow. I'm getting like regular rares out of everything. Noibat, Horsey, Alone Vulpix, Sneasel. That, I will take a reverse Alone Vulpix. Another regular rare. That's six packs in a row. All regular rares. Not a single hollow card. Not a single one. <sighs> you know, that's, that's, honestly, it's devastating is what it is. It's just devastating. Last two packs, guys. Last two packs. Ho-ho, bring me luck. God, these packs just rip open. These are way easier than... The other packs. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Nope, not at all. I've opened so many packs recently, and I don't know how many times I can say it. I'm terrible at opening these. Absolutely terrible. Four from the back. Pretty much. Pretty much at this point. I would take anything, honestly. Like, even just a hollow. Like, I can't believe I'm I'm six packs in. Seven packs now. But, I mean, my luck could turn here. That is a nice card. Too bad they don't... Oh, my God. Finally, a hollow Lysinorok. And reverse. I'll take both of those. Those are actually two pretty beautiful cards. Not gonna lie. I'm going to put that Lucinarok in a sleeve. I, at this point, I might as well just frame it because it's the only one I'm getting out of this whole trainer box. All right. Last pack. Want to take bets on if I get something out of this? I would not bet on me at this moment. That is for sure. An Inke with a cool, like, drawn on art, which is pretty dope. Four from the back. Pray and hope. Just pray. Oh man, I'm nervous. Olivia, Lumatone, an Inke, a Duskull, Tianmo. Tinamo, Cool Rilu, a reverse Acerola. Nope. I. That whole trainer box, I got one hollow. One. Unbelievable, man. That was an absolute waste of $30. An absolute waste. 
Unbelievable. One hollow in that whole trainer box. I'm I'm a little devastated, honestly. I don't know if I'll ever come back from that. One hollow and like, yeah, it's a cool hollow. Like I paid thirty dollars for this. Just this one card. Nuts, man. Absolutely nuts. Put these cards back here with the rest of them. I have yet to go through all my cards, so they're kind of just sitting back there. Like, let's look at this and see what cards I could have pulled. A full art Tapu Pin, a full art Salazzle, a full art Ho. That would have been nice. This full art Ho Ho right here. Actually, you guys can't see that very well. Four, eight, twelve. Thirteen rainbow cards. Four, eight. And nine gold cards. And I could pull one hollow out of eight packs. Unbelievable. An oof trainer box doesn't even begin to describe that, honestly. That was absolutely atrocious three trainer boxes and this is all i pull a bd in ddv zassian v snorlax v holographic copper jaw holographic inteleon holographic cinderace and a holographic lacinarok unbelievable man a waste of money is what that was Let me put these full arts away. clean up this mess a little bit and then I'm gonna go open all my online packs that I had from yesterday which is 50 plus packs let me move that open this Yeah, it's, I love it. I love opening packs. There's something so relaxing about it. Ooh, that is loud. Ooh, Unified Minds. Let's see, how many packs do we have today to open? Move my camera back to its original position. Give me one second. I'm just checking something on my phone. to open up some more packs hopefully like I said I have 36 cosmic eclipse one unified mind and 14 sword and shield let's open up this bag anyway. Continues normal rare 
it's not as heartbreaking opening regular or opening online packs. It's not as heartbreaking. So let's say a lot of packs. Another regular rare. Ooh, two cards to play here. A reverse Mushana. A regular rare Drampa. Awesome. Kill me. I do. Wait a minute, why is it not? I didn't touch the screen size. why it's not going full screen again. What did I do to it? I only messed with the volume. I didn't think I clicked it, but I guess I did. Like I said, I just wanted to turn this volume down a little bit. It was so loud. You know, not looking too good. Not looking too good. Looking just about as bad as that would be. No bug, lucky egg. Lucky egg, though, I will take those. The reverse bolt gun. Regular rare Drapian. Unbelievable. My luck is not changing whatsoever. It's a hollow. Could be worse. And plus, Gengar is one of my favorite Pokemon. I will take as many Gengars as I can. Unbelievable. Two Galarian Rapid Ashes regular rares in three packs. Monster. Oh, Bill Bug Reverse. Ooh, a Reggie Rock. This is actually the only Reggie I didn't get in a V card so far. I think I have Reggie Ice and Reggie Steel already, so I'll take that. At least it's a V. I hate Mud Bray. I hate him. He's cute and all, but I hate him. Regular Rare Clay Doll. I didn't even know Clay Doll was in this pack, like this set, honestly. Ooh, two of them this time. A reverse. 
first frost boss. I don't know why it would make me put that one. Regular rare Santa Cobra. Or Santa Conda. Nice. Another holographic Bolton. I have so many of these in real life already. You know, I can use a few more online. Another Drompa. Dude, he's haunting me, man. I'm gonna dream about him tonight. Terrible. Pokemon Center Lady, nice. A reverse Team Yelbra. Another regular rare Drapion. Unbelievable, man. So upsetting, honestly. I spend my hard earned money on these cards just to get crapped on. Clobbers reverse. <laughs> Another one. All right, so those are absolutely terrible. Roblox, Twitch, what's up, man? You know, just getting disappointed by opening packs online, the usual. And in real life, too, actually. Another Pular Excadrill. Nice. A holographic Magneton. It's, ar it's already better than the booster boxes in real life that I got today. That that is a really cool looking card. I really like that actually. Very cute. Wait a minute. I still think this volume is too loud. Oh, it's because I put it back up to... Okay. There we go. What's up, Roblox Twitch? How are you doing today, man? I just finished opening some booster boxes in real life, got really disappointed, and then, now, look at that, I got it in real life too, let's go, it's the best pull I got today, and it's not even in real life. That card's going for a lot of money right now too, for some reason, like I can get a lot for it. Oh my god, back to back? Oh my god! Unbelievable. I just pulled Reshiram and Zekrom back to back packs. Oh dude, nuts man. These are already better than everything I opened today in real life. Just pulling two of those is just crazy. You know, I'm okay with a regular rare. That's fine. I still have 30 packs left, too. 30. That is a cool looking card. I haven't pulled any of those in real life. A goaler. Tangla. Classic, man. Absolute classic. A Glalie. Cool. Regular rare Glalie. I probably jinxed you, right? I'm probably not going to open anything even popular the rest of this. All 28 of these packs left. Another regular rare Ursaring. Onyx, Peltoad, a reverse Rockruff. 
<laughs> All the regular rares are just stacking up right now, though. They're absolutely terrible. Yeah, I did. I jinxed it. It's over. Nothing good. At, nothing else good is coming out of this. Apom, Golet, a Deerling, Cynthia, and Caitlyn. The Pyroar is cool. Reverse Trap Inch. I I actually pulled yesterday in real life. I pulled a Reverse Kyogre and Groudon in the same. Or no, they were two packs. I mean, it weren't the same, but. Uh, that whole series and set of Pokemon. I have a quiz. What is your favorite Pokemon? My favorite Pokemon of all time is Machamp. I absolutely love Machamp. He's always been one of my favorites. I, he, he just looks like a badass. He's got four arms. He could probably throw a car. Whoa, a full art Torkoal? Let's go. What? Why would they flip this one second? Shouldn't have been the other way? Whatever. Yeah, Machamp is my favorite by far. Blastoise is up there. Gengar is up there. But Machamp is my favorite. What is your favorite? You two smash. What's your favorite? Let me turn the volume down real quick on my Spotify. Actually, let's pause it. Skeptile. Skeptile's the homie. He was my favorite starter from that generation. Vulpix. Both Fire and Alorn. Oh, I pulled this in real life too. Or a Corio. I like Vulpix. I've always liked Vulpix. I think Nine Tails is awesome. I, honestly, I like the original Pokemon, man. There's just something about them. The nostalgia. Of the original Pokemon, or just there's something about it. I love it. Graveler was like one of my favorites back then too. Ooh, a full art Magnemite. And another regular rare Slurp Buff. I will take that though. That is awesome. That artwork is so nice. Alright guys, I still got 20 packs after this. Still got 20. Heliolisk. What is... What is FNAF? FNAF. What is that? Is that like an acronym for a card that I don't know of? A scrope. Lily's Pokey Doll. That's a nice card for the game. Look at that. There you go. Alolan Vulpix. That's for you, Smash. Oh, that is my fourth Entei card that I have. I have two regulars and two GX Entei's. Entei is my favorite dog of the four legendary or three legendary dogs. So I will take as many as those as I can get. Another one. Ugh, uh, man. Give me a different card. I'm fine with it because it's two GX cards. I do not have that game, no. But I've heard a lot about it. A re I don't know. See, why is this flipped? There's nothing, like, special about it, but... That is... That is a sick artwork. I really like that. I love seeing all the different artworks for Pikachu. There's so many artworks for her. Or for it. I don't know why I always assume Pikachu was a girl. Rufflet. Boring. Sandy 
gas, the Larvesta, Ends Resolve, Amber Palm. Regular Rare, Embor. Another Amphibom, Ambipom, a Will Reverse, <laughs> another Drompa, man, so many Drompas, like I said, I'm going to have nightmares about Drompa tonight, it's going to be awful, little baby, a fairy, a regular rare Mag Cargo. A B sharp. Jangmo. Another regular rare seismitoad. Roblox Twitch, I do not have five nights at Freddy's. I did say that already. But no, I don't have it. And I have never played it actually either. I just I know about it. Didn't it it used to be a show, didn't it? Isn't that what it originally was? A show? Mar Shadow. Alright guys, I got 10 more packs after this. Cosmog, Tangro, Clay, of the Brava. Ooh, you know, I'll take it. It's a hollow. Okay, I've had pretty good luck when there's two cards flipped, so let's see if it keeps going. I will take that. I love Steelix. Another Alolan Ninetales. Hey, Smash, if you have a online Pokemon like account, like you play this online, you can have a Alolan Ninetales and Alolan Vulpix. Since I have, I'm pretty sure I have doubles of both of them. So, if you want them, you know. Heliolisk. You know, I haven't really had the greatest luck. Kirlia. Regular rare Cridilly. Type no, that is cool artwork of Maywild or Ma Wild. Really, two regular rare Fridillies in a row. That kind of breaks my heart. I'm gonna be putting a Pokemon Kelma from the disappointment. A reverse well rain. Ooh, that is actually pretty cool. I'll take that. All right, Smash, you have a good night. Thank you for watching. You're very kind and very nice. And my name on Pokemon is the exact same thing as my stream name. I'm down to battle anytime. Oh, a revert. I have this in real life too, a black green or a Caillou Rim. Regular rare Slurpuff. Okay, four packs left. Chaotic Swell. Well, Lord. Awesome. Oh, a reverse Ultra Necrozma. I have the regular hollow in real life. Oh, let's go! I pulled a gold. Giant Hearth. Once during each player's turn, that player may discard a card from their hand if they do. Oh, I have this in regular too. Oh man, that's so exciting. I finally pulled a gold online. It has taken me so long. 
And with only two packs to go. Sure, man. I'll follow you. When I'm done streaming, I will... Is it... Are you talking about on Twitch? Ooh, a hollow Guzzlord. Your opponent's Pokemon is knocked out by damage from this attack. Take one more prize card. Discard the top card of your opponent's deck. Actually, that's a pretty good Buzzlord. Or Guzzlord. Alright, last online pack. Nope, regular rare. Doesn't even matter. Oh, actually, I could type all these codes in and I could open 16 more packs if I wanted to. Yes, I will follow you. I'll, you know what? I'll go on Twitch right now and follow you. Here, type something in chat for me again, man, so I can see it. Here you go. I am your first official follower. That was just for you. Okay. Move these to the side. I am going to type these codes in and redeem these too as well. Oh, I didn't even click that wrong button. Yeah, it doesn't work actually because I'm streaming. I can't do that. I do want to redeem these though, these other packs that I have. Hopefully these will give me a little better luck than they did in real life because I literally didn't pull a single thing from all these Burning Shadows packs and it was a little heartbreaking. Click that, man. I hope so. I don't know if you were here for when I opened all the the Burning Shadows packs, but I literally didn't pull anything. Literally didn't get anything good from the whole Elite Trainer box. And like I said, that is probably why they are still sitting on the shelves at Walmart. They probably don't have good pull rates or something like that, and people probably just don't want to buy them because... 
usually people hop all over like older booster boxes and booster packs and like elite trainer boxes and stuff like that so seeing like older boxes like those sitting there was kind of surprising but you know maybe that's why My bad. I will talk more and pay more attention to everything when I'm done typing these all in. I'm just, you know, doing my best to focus. Shouldn't have too many left. I hate typing stuff in like this. I hate looking down constantly. It kills my neck. probably end the stream and then start it back up when 
I start playing something else. Last one. Okay, let's go. Time to open up some more packs. Okay, let's see. So I got 16, I'm going to open, open Sword and Shield, 16 Sword and Shield, and 8 Burning Shadows. Let's hope Burning Shadows is a little better, because opening in real life was absolutely terrible. I got one hollow out of 8 packs, that is it. Absolutely broke my heart. But here I am, opening some more. If I can get a gold online, you know, I'd be fine. I wouldn't be too upset by it, but I have almost all these cards. Ooh, let's go. A V. A Celebi V. I don't have that card yet either, so that will look nice. Oh, I pulled it on the game too. Oh my god. Oh man. Nuts. I can't believe I pulled a rainbow in real life and online and it was the same rainbow card. Crazy man. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Reverse Pokemon catcher. A regular Corviknight. I literally have all these cards already. Interesting. Reverse Snorlax. And... A regular rare Dreadnought. A reverse rare Cincino. Cincino. And a regular rare Ninetales. Hmm. Not great luck again, but that's okay. Ooh, a Morpico V. I don't have this card either. Spark, this attack does plume more damage when your opponent's bench Pokemon. Doesn't apply to weakness. And Electro Wheel, discard an energy from this Pokemon. If you do, switch it with one of your benched Pokemon. Hmm. Very nice. Very nice V-card. I will take that. These are already going pretty well, honestly, for online. Wow. How redundant. A more Pico V and a regular rare more Pico. Back-to-back -back openings. Galarian Lanoon. Mincino. A Krogunk. Another Celebi V. Like... Three packs. I had two Celebi V cards. Ooh, a Reverse Inteleon. And a regular rare Mudsdale. Ooh. That, that attack can be devastating. You get two heads, 240, coming from a regular card. It does take four energy to use, though. That's a lot of energy to use on a regular card. It doesn't really offer you much else. A reverse Kevin Durant. What's up, man? And a regular rare Inteleon. I have, I feel like I have every version of Inteleon. Everyone. Reverse, Hollow, V. I believe he does have a V Max, though. Ooh, a regular rare Lapras. 
I feel like I should definitely make a water deck. I, have a, I feel like I have a lot of rare water cards. Ooh, I have this in real life too. A holographic Cinderace. I have two more packs of Sword and Shield, and I have the eight packs of Crimson Rush. Another reverse Snorlax. And another holographic Boltund. Man, oh man. Last pack of Sword and Shield. See what I get? Grab lock. Grab locked. Oh, let's go! Two rainbows coming out of the 16 Sword and Shield packs I get. Two rainbows and a gold. I forgot I got a gold Hearthstone. That is that is huge opening. That is so lucky, honestly. Let's see what I get out of my Crimson Moon. Dude, I, I'm not getting... That's not what these are called either, is it? I'm messing up this name so bad. With a reverse Venipede. That is already cooler than all the cards that I got in the actual cards. Burning Shadows. I need to get that right. I cannot keep messing that up. A reverse Noibat. Crabominable. A regular rare Crabominable. These are honestly going just about as good as they did in real life, which wasn't good at all. So, not looking forward to this. Please, please, Arceus, if you're up there, give me something. Give me something here. Oh, let's go! Lucina Rock Rainbow! Oh, man. Thank you so much. Oh, man. That is a beautiful card. Absolutely beautiful card. Two packs left. See if I can get lucky and pull anything else. Reverse Azamero. Oh, I will take that. A Gardevoir GX. Okay. Oh, actually, I have four packs left. I thought I only had two. So I do have a chance of drawing something else. That... Dude, that is a cool-looking card. I don't care what anybody says. I don't even care that it's only reverse. That is a cool-looking Zygarde. You know. It happens. It happens to the best of us. Nothing you can do about it. Two packs left. All right. Give me something here. Something to look forward to here. Heartbreaker. Absolute heartbreaker is what it is. Last pack of the night, boys. And girls. That is a cool card. You know, it happens. Uh, I think I'm going to call it there, guys. I opened all my packs today. So thanks for watching. I will see you guys later. Peace.